What's up you guys? Hi, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new, hi, this is Anshu. I create content around beauty, makeup, skincare, fashion, hair care, anything related to beauty you will find out in this channel. And I love drugs to makeup, affordable skincare, fashion, hair care. So yeah, if that's interest you, please consider subscribing and like this video, share my videos with your friends and families. Now without further ado, let's get started. So in this video, I'm so excited, but I'm like so confused also. So today I'm what I'm going to do. I have already done a numerous amount of videos. In. So if you are guys following me for a long time, you guys, guys must know I have done like top five foundation, um, concealer, everything. So I have ranked all of my makeup like top five. But today I'm going to rank brands. Yes, I have seen a lot of um, you know um, foreign beauty bloggers uh, like uh, Hannah from Smoky Glow and currently I saw her but I have seen yeah Kelly Gooch and a lot of people in uh, you know uh, a lot of bloggers in the US I have saw doing this so yeah I'm going to do this in uh, two categories first uh, is affordable than drugstore so there is a difference in my opinion in affordable and drugstore makeup drugstore makeup means like more mainstream brands and affordable means yeah like really really affordable brands so yeah just going to rank them and i'm not talking about products i'm talking about brands in general i'm going to talk about like uh, maybe one favorite product but it's about brand not about products today i'm going to rank all the affordable brands that i have tried in 2021 we are talking about 2021 okay this can change next year so uh, as this year is already about to end so i thought of doing this next year also i will do this and we will see that uh, is there any changes or i still love the same brands okay so yeah number fifth i was so confused but let's just keep miss clear there oh my god they launched their um uh, foundation and it was like really really good i wore it on like diwali and a family function it is a very 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 good uh, for you know foundation very well formulated and on mintra it was like 170 rupees <laughs> so it's like crazy affordable but good coverage dewy finish foundation and i have ranked it so high in my foundation ranking also you can check that and i really like that so and they have launched their blushes oh my god 16 shades of blushes so pretty 16 shades of foundation so pretty and yeah both of these products i have used so much from this brand i have tried their concealer was like nice but not awesome shading now they have the prestige line i will definitely test that out uh, in the coming you know like january i think because this year is already over okay so but yeah miss clear was launching so good uh, makeup and i'm really impressed by the quality of miss clear and so affordable so affordable now they have their prestige line i will definitely test that out for affordable makeup i think uh, swiss beauty will be in top fifth for me and yeah miss clear i really enjoyed this liner this year i tried this and today i also have this this is a very pretty pretty liner i loved it and so yeah so yeah I, i'm just talking about brands and not about their products so but still i'm telling you which were like my tip top favorite products from these brands so yeah fourth i was so confused but uh, let's just give it to swiss beauty i love their concealer it's my holy grail i think that concealer can beat any high-end concealer for just their concealer itself i think totally worth it now they're uh, like lipstick so yeah their lipstick especially this one i was like really impressed by the quality it does not feels like a 200 rupees lipstick and a really inexpensive brand which makes quality makeup packaging awesome the swiss beauty palette today i have on my eyes is like you cannot tell it's that this is an affordable palette it is so good and swiss beauty in general like know how to make good quality makeup under the price tag of 200 300 and yeah their intense kajal i used it so much it, if you want a budge free kajal like really good good quality um, you know those gel liners were really good and i think swiss beauty is also a very good quality drugstore brand i just loved it and now on the third position uh, like this video is getting tough so i'm going to keep ny bay also on the third position literally ny bay is launching constantly so good quality makeup under the price tag of 200 rupees which is 
crazy their primer i like uh, their foundation the recent launch is so good does not feels like uh, 200 rupees foundation honestly the blush oh my god i i have to literally stop myself from using that blush i was constantly using only that blush and the eye shadows were good everything they are launching it's like good and their kajal is like so budget free and you will get it for 60 rupees oh my god they know how to make affordable good quality makeup so yeah really awesome launches i have to try their uh, shadow stick as well it's just really pretty unique makeup if you want in affordable affordable try nyb they have like so unique shades of eye shadow pencils under the price tag of 100 rupees so i don't know how they do it they make such good quality affordable makeup that is like so good um i love their foundation as i told you the you know their nine pens are also really good and the blushes you know i told you i was like i have to literally stop myself because i was using oh so, yeah i was just using this blush only so uh, they have the highlighter also highlighter is also really good quality so yeah nyb um, the lipstick i have the peppy pearson lipstick their uh, liquid lipstick is like 140 rupees non drying good pigmentation lipstick their concealer is really good oh my god each and everything they have launched i am i'm like yet to uh, get a disappointing product from nyb and i don't know how they do it like under the price tag of 200 rupees how do they make such good quality makeup i'm like so so impressed and literally shook and yeah a very very inexpensive but good quality brand which also make unique makeup if you want that you can check and vibe okay uh, next and the second most i was so confused which uh, to keep on second position oh my god if you ask me this year was the year go <laughs> this year goes to mars and instite oh my god they were back to back launches by both of the brands and the, they have like the price point is pretty neck to neck like and yeah these two brands i don't i don't know they are competing with each other i guess because they are doing it they are making like so inexpensive makeup but it does not feel cheap at all it's like really good quality affordable makeup so yeah i have the uh, so in second position i will keep insight and yeah Let, let me just tell you why i'm keeping insight on second and mars on first okay first of all uh, both of the brands have uh, i think their niche so this is the insight new foundation is their dewy high coverage foundation i am constantly using this this is so so good quality foundation does not feels like a 200 rupees foundation at all the only con, con with both of the brands is the shade range okay uh, so yeah that's the only con with both of them and i have tried uh, from insight their lipstick top notch their foundation i have tried i think four or five foundation from insight amazing quality foundation they know how to make foundation just uh, they don't know how to make shades or they don't want to i don't know what is the tea with that uh, if they will improve the shade range um, they can beat the other you know truck store makeup i think they can easily beat them in the terms of foundation like it's so lightweight this foundation and it is a very good hydrating uh, full coverage foundation really really good their lipstick are really good quality uh, this uh, highlighter literally broke the internet everybody was buying this reviewing this from beauty bloggers who have 1 million plus followers also were buying this 90 rupees highlighter so you can understand they have huda they have everything and still they are buying this and everybody was uh, you know so pumped up because this uh, this makeup line is awesome they are uh, their primer is good foundation is good their concealer wheel i have it's, it's so creamy and good and uh, yeah the only thing uh, they lack is uh, eye shadow i have not uh, yeah and blushes uh, yeah i have not seen uh, these products from uh, inside so i wish they will include eye shadow palettes and blushes into their collection so that you know i can do full face and i have a lot of foundation concealer and i have a bronzer their bronzer is also their contour stick um, yeah so the contour stick is so so good so creamy so blendable and i think a very good inexpensive brand and does not feels like a affordable brand like the call the packaging you can say but the quality of product is really good so yeah just they need to make more eye shadows and blushes so they will be my top favorite maybe next year now on top i am keeping mars cosmetic oh my god <laughs> back to back launches back to back awesome launches i don't know how these new brands do that they make such inexpensive makeup so high quality and 
does not feels like affordable brand in terms of quality of product yeah with packaging it's like normal packaging uh, but uh, about packaging also uh, i forgot to bring here the wonder uh, line you have seen by mars they have such beautiful packaging also now they are improving on that area so yeah they are all the eye shadows i have tried so many oh my god i can show you my uh, mars cosmetic uh, eye shadow palette collection they know how to make eye shadows for like less than 200 rupees and yeah they just know how, what they are doing yeah i mean they are phenomenal when it comes to eye shadow lipstick and uh, yeah i i have not seen uh, like uh, blushes from mars they have a palette i'm talking about single blushes yeah they they are highlighter i just love the highlighter it's so good and do i have to tell i am constantly using ever since i bought this i'm constantly using this i have like almost used this half and it's a very new product but i have used this all of my videos so do i have to even talk about this like i have talked about this like so much and yeah mars is like killing it they have better shade range uh, like they found, uh, they just have a good bb cream uh, the mars uh, Blossom foundation is the only foundation that is uh, matching me perfectly right now because I have lost all my tans, and this is a very good dupe of K by uh, Katrina, the foundation uh, by K by K Beauty. So um, I don't know how they do it. They they just also need to improve the shade range. That is the only con. Otherwise, and yeah, make more bronzer blushes. That's my suggestion would be to them. Otherwise, they are making such good quality products like. less than 200 300 rupees i don't know how these two brands these two brands specially i don't know how they are constantly launching new makeup that to this affordable good quality makeup so yeah i'm so so impressed and yeah i hope these two brands will keep on launching so that i can uh, you know review that for you guys also so yeah that's pretty much it for this video i was excited to do this <laughs> although for top 3 i was confused but yeah so that's pretty much it for this video if you have watched this till end thanks for watching uh, thanks for watching my videos and yeah if you like this video please do not forget to like this video give it a thumbs up uh, subscribe to this channel turn on the notification bell and yeah i shall see you in my next one bye